in this video, let's talk about nosy Loki haters. All right. So, first of all, not everybody who watches you and watches what you do is a supporter of yours. Not all these people that are watching you have good intentions towards you. Um, especially the ones that always constantly watch but they will never like any of your stuff. Now you might see them on Instagram or something like this, they'll always view your story, but they literally never, 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 never like anything you do. They never have anything good to say. They're just watching. And don't get it mistaken either because not every single person is a nosy low-key hater either. There's, there could be some people that are watching but they never like your stuff, maybe because they don't even want you to see they don't want you to see them walk that they, they don't want you to see them watching your stuff. Like they don't want to know that you're seeing that they're watching you. You know what I'm saying? Um You just have to be careful with these people. You have to be careful of all the snakes in the grass because they are out there. They're always going to be there. And like I said, not everybody who watches your stuff is a hater. They're not. A lot of people are curious. They're just curious. You have to know the difference between a hater and a curious person. Um, even your haters, they honestly do. They love you. They admire you. That's why they're watching your stuff. But it's like it gives them anxiety whenever they see you doing something good because they might not be doing something good or whatever, you know? No judgment. But it makes them feel some type of way. The, the closer you become to succeeding, it just like it's, they're hating you more and more, but it's all love at the end of the day. And one of the most dangerous people honestly can be a nosy low-key hater because some of these people really do despise you and they still watch all your stuff. It's amazing, isn't it? I don't understand why or how this works because... I don't watch anything I don't like that I'm not taking inspiration from. It just it's, it's doing nothing for me. I don't understand why people hate on other people. It makes absolutely no sense. It's like they want to deny the fact that a person is actually who they are and a person is actually doing what they're doing. But it makes no sense. You know what I'm saying? Like, I just don't understand how people can do that. It baffles me to this day, and it always has. It makes no sense. I have 0% hate in my heart. I could not watch somebody and just hate what they're doing. Like, like I said, like I'm the least judgmental person you could possibly come across. Um, I even tell my friends this, and my younger friends, like, guys, like, seriously, try everything. Try whatever you want to try, and... Who gives a fuck what anybody else has to say because I know for a fact if you guys do do what you want to do and you want to try different things people are people are going to laugh at you people are going to say things to you to try to get in your head to try to stop you from doing what you're doing because they know you have potential they see it in you and they will make up jokes they will laugh and do all these things to try to discourage you to try to get you in fear to try to get you to lose this is a true hater this is a true hater, and they actually hate themselves for doing this. I've had these people that I came across in my life. Like, it was probably the worst. And, like, 2019 was probably the year that I've seen the most of this happen. And eventually, you just start to shut everybody up because I've lashed out at people before, and they got, they got terrified. They got scared. I've seen it in them. And if you rub me the wrong way, especially in person, I might take your head off. And I mean really rub me the wrong way. Like, you can't do that. I'm going to show you why you can't do that. You know what I mean? People are ignorant. People are arrogant. People are actually like this out there in the real world. And I don't put up with it. And 
I will stick up for all my friends. Like I said, I will tell everybody, try whatever you want to try, do whatever you want to do. I'm here to support it. I'll be the first one to support what you're doing. You could start a business in the porn industry. I'm for it. I'm for it. Let's do it. And I will support you. I'm just an intense guy like that and I'm passionate when it comes to certain things that people want to do and I'm not going, to, what's the point of hating on it? Do you know what I mean? This is what I'm trying to get across in this video. Maybe I can get into the mind of a hater on this video to make them wisen up a little bit because it's like, bro, like, what's the point of hating? What is it going to do for you to put doubt and fear into another person's head? You're accomplishing nothing yourself. This is not going to get you to win. So why are you doing this? You know what I mean? It makes no sense. It just makes zero sense. It's completely absurd to even see any of these types of behavior still existing to this day. It's just like, do you want to be labeled as a hater, bro? Is that really what you want to be labeled by? Because we can all make you look like a fool if we want to. <laughs> the true fools are the haters. It's foolish behavior. It's stupid behavior. It makes no sense. It doesn't matter how stupid somebody else looks for trying something they want to try, even if they don't succeed. Guess what? They tried. You didn't. When did it ever become cool not to try? Is not trying anything cool? No. You're much more cooler if you're trying things and you're not succeeding at it because when you continue to try certain things, you're going to eventually succeed. That's just how it works. So, um, it just blows my mind, guys, how people can actually act and behave like this towards other people. And like I said, if you're somebody that wants to try something, I'll be the first person to support you. I'll be the first person to stick up to you and I will stick it to the haters. I will call them out. I will make them look stupid. I love that. You can't disrespect me, you can't disrespect my friends, you can't make other people look foolish because you have a massive ego and you want to see everybody else fail to make yourself look better even though you don't look like anything. That doesn't make you look better either. These haters and the people that have hate in their heart, they think it makes them look worse if other people are succeeding and they are not. Uh, it's absolutely doing nothing for you. You just have to focus on yourself. It makes no sense. Get your mind right. Get everything else right. Like, what are you thinking in the run of a day? What are you doing in the run of a day? If you have to work, if you have to go to your job, if you have to do this, if you have to do that, go make your money, come home, and get right. Work on your side hustles, work on your business, work on something. Think of something and start doing it. Start trying. Who cares what everybody else thinks? I'll be the first person to support you. This is just my mindset, guys. This is the beliefs that I have. And I know what it's like to have these nosy, low-key haters. And I just laugh at every single one of them. I think it's hilarious. Because some of these people really want to try to make you look foolish. Some of these people will gang up together. And um, they'll get in groups. And they'll talk absolute smack about you to make you look just like the biggest idiot on earth. They will literally do this, even though you are succeeding and even though you are doing something good and you're doing something that they cannot do. They will still do this. And they will laugh amongst themselves, even though deep down inside, in the core being of every single one of those people that are doing this, they know you're for real. And they know you are on a different level than they are. That's why they're doing this, because it's the only thing they can do to protect their own egos. And that's what they need to do to feel a little bit of confidence because you are making them feel less confident about themselves because of who you are and what you're doing and what you're pursuing and the success you're having doing what you're doing. Right? Makes sense. But it doesn't make sense. You know what I mean? The psychology behind it, it makes sense, but it doesn't fucking make sense because it's just stupid, foolish behavior, like I said. Um, and this is why I'm doing this video too, is because you have to weave out who's actually a hater and who's actually not. Because some people that might watch your stuff, 
They might not support you. They might not like your stuff. They're honestly just curious. They're honestly just curious. They think who you are is probably cool. They probably think what you're doing is cool. What you're doing is different. It's like, wow, look at this guy, look at this girl, what they're doing. I'm curious. I don't want them to know I'm watching them. I don't want to feel like a stalker, but it's like I'm, I'm interested in who this person is and what they're doing. So don't get it mixed up. Don't think everybody's a hater because they're not. Most people actually are not. So let's just get that clear. But they're always, there's always going to be somebody, and that's the thing. So you just have to be aware of who is actually a hater and who is actually not. You have to be aware of who is actually smiling in your face in a hater type of way and who might give you a smile that honestly just genuinely likes you. So <clears throat> that's really all I have to say in this video, guys. Just be aware of this stuff. These are things, and what I'm explaining right now is things that I've learned throughout the years. Probably for the last about three years, I've been learning more about this stuff and the psychology behind it as everything else that I preach and teach on this channel. Um, it's an amazing time to be alive. It's an amazing time to get all this information and knowledge. Knowledge is power. Um, you want to understand people. You want to understand why people do the things they do, why they think the way they think, why they think the way they think towards you and other things as well. Um, it just makes life that much better because you don't want to misunderstand people. Um, communication is everything and some people are not going to communicate with you but you still want to understand them and their intentions towards you so this is the point of this video um i'm going to cut it off now i said i was going to do a video last night on astrology but i had a bunch of phone calls last night um about cars that i'm currently looking at halfway across canada so that got in the, in the way of making another video. I'll hopefully get another video in tonight. Um, not 100% sure on it, but on Sunday, I'll most likely get three videos in. So we'll see about this evening, guys. I'm going to cut this video short. I hope you guys have a great rest of this Saturday evening and enjoy it for sure. I will be back.